hello everyone. <coughs> My name is Jachaed. I'm a freshly graduated software engineer uh, working at Bashroom in France. And today I will sh uh, share with you what I've been doing for the last six months uh, as a, a mentee uh, for the project VTS. My name is Deepti Sigredi. I'm the project lead and maintainer for VTS, which is what we'll be talking about today. Uh, you probably noticed the Vitas logo on the landscape that Lori and Catherine presented. Vitas is a graduated project. It was created at YouTube over 10 years ago and became a part of CNCF in 2018. So it's been around for a while. Vitas is a cloud native database system which is built around MySQL. It's highly scalable, distributed, and it's been adopted by many large companies. For example, Slack, every Slack message. Many of you are on Slack right now. Every Slack message is going through Vitess. GitHub, every pull request, every issue is going through Vitess. And f many people run it on their own, but for those who don't want to run it on their own, PlanetScale runs a managed database service on Vitess. Next up, are we fast yet? Are we fast yet is our benchmarking tool. We run benchmarks daily, and we publish those results on its own website, which is rvfastyet.vitas.io. We run several standard database workloads, and we perform statistical analysis on those, and that is what we publish. Here's an architecture of RV Fastyet. I'm not actually going to go through this, but anyone who wants to can uh, look at it afterwards in the slides. So what we did with Are We Fast Yet is that we decided to participate in the LFX mentoring program and get a mentee to revamp the website. The website has been around for several years, and it was due for a facelift. So we did uh, an initial attempt at it in a previous mentorship term, and then we sort of got everything working uh, in the recent term that ended in June. So the way the mentorship process works is that a project decides to apply to the LFX mentorship program that's, uh, that CNCF participates in, and you define a, a project and a scope of tasks for the mentee, and you open up a PR on the CNCF mentoring repository. People apply to the mentorship program, and then we go over all the applications, do some interviews, and select a mentee and an alternate. And once the mentee accepts uh, the project, then we are ready to start the mentorship. And in this case, it was Jad who was selected as the mentor. OK, so now I will share with you my journey as a mentee. So first of all, I just learned about this opportunity through a LinkedIn post for, from the CNCF team. Uh, it was relating to a GitHub issue uh, that, was li that was listing every mentorship for this specific term, so from June to August. I then made uh, two interviews, and i been chosen to be a mentee for Vitesse. So the first step was the onboarding. Uh, so my mentor, Florent Poinsard, who couldn't be there today, um, told me everything I had to know about our fastient and Vitesse and now how how we facet is helping with this. Then uh, he explained me how an open source project works as a maintainer, and finally introduced me to the team during a monthly meeting from Vitesse. So after this presentation with the team, I could start my journey. Uh, so I began uh, doing a public Figma Jamboard. Uh, which looked like this. So I had to redesign every pages of our facet, uh, both in light and dark time, and uh, the ability to be responsive. After that, I implemented this design, so I made a total revamp of our facet, um, and at the same time, I improved the code quality of the whole project. So here are some examples. For example, the status page, so it is a before after. We added some metrics and added a chart. And for the daily page, we improve the UI uh, to make it more readable for users, uh, passing to the search engine design. Then I suggested some new features. Uh, my mentor was pretty open to implement them. 
on our facet, uh, such as a history page and uh, some other features like a global search bar and an admin dashboard that makes it easy for the maintainer of Vitesse to add uh, some benchmarks. And finally, a demonstration in September. So to conclude, um, I will say that I try to keep contributing as much as possible because I love this project. Uh, in terms of personal growth, it just showed me that I want to work full time for the open source community and uh, in the CFCM, a CNCF project. And finally, if you want to, more, more, to know more about my journey, you can check the Vitesse blog, blog where I made the blog post. So from the perspective of the project, this was actually a significant contribution. We got an entire new UI out of it. We revamped the queue for uh, benchmark execution. There is a new admin page that maintainers can use to schedule ad hoc benchmarks versus the nightly benchmarks. So this was actually a, a great program that we are glad we participated in. So thank you to the LFX team and the CNCF team. To learn more about Wittes, uh, please feel free to visit our website, wittes.io. We have a Slack workspace. We have links to our GitHub. We have links to past talks. And we also have our maintainer talk on Friday at 2 PM. So I hope to see many of you there. Thank you. Thank you very much.